Hi everyone, I'm Sarah and I'm Pauline and today's article is Italian Town Bans Cricket. So if you know anything about cricket, it doesn't seem like a bannable sport. So we're going to have to read the article today to figure out why this town has banned such a peaceful sport. But thinking about Italy first, have you ever been to Italy before? No, I have never been to Italy. I've never been to Europe actually, but it's, mm -hmm. it's a place that I've always wanted to visit. Um, when I was maybe like in middle school, I was really interested in Italian, so I mm -hmm. tried teaching myself Italian. It didn't go well. <laughs> so, yeah, I haven't been. Um, <laughs> How about yourself? I, I have been to Italy one time. I went on a wine tour Ooh. and I went to Florence and the surrounding area to go on a wine tour. Great. I highly recommend it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What about cricket then? Do you know anything about cricket? So. I know that cricket, like baseball, is like a, the remix of mm. cricket, the right? The remix. Yeah. <laughs> um, one of the uh, like differences that stood out to me is the bat that they use mm -hmm. because uh, baseball has a more... Rounded? Uh, yeah, it's rounded and <laughs> the surface area to hit the ball is it's much less than with the cricket one, mm. which is flat and you get more of a paddle form. So. Yes. Then that's to the, that's the extent that I know. I don't know the rules. I don't know. Oh, they have eleven players. Mm -hmm. I think that's that's the extent of knowledge because I don't know well about the game at all. Mm, I guess it's not really played in America, mm -hmm. right? Uh, as a British person, I know quite a lot about cricket because it's our national pastime, especially in the summer. Mm. So uh, I grew up watching the the biggest event that happens, which is called the Ashes, which is the UK versus Australia. And because of that, uh, many school children love playing cricket or the the uh, easier version, which is called rounders. It's mm -hmm. the first sport that you kind of learn when you're at school in the UK. So, mm -hmm. yeah, I know quite a lot about it. I still enjoy watching it to this day. Have you played it? I have. Mm -hmm. uh, it was actually the first sport that I ever learned to play at school. So we started off with rounders, which is a little bit more like baseball. It has a a rounded bat because it's easier to hit and mm -hmm. then as you get older you get the skills to finally learn how to do the cricket move mm -hmm. which is oh I really enjoy it and then actually one of my friends from high school she's a player for the British team wow now. so if you <laughs> if you have any interest you can check her out mmm that's amazing <laughs> yeah very interesting so Take a look at the article. Remember that there is a summary if you don't have time to read the full thing. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Italian Town Bans Cricket Cricket is a widely popular sport, well known for its high standards of etiquette and fair play. But authorities in the Italian town of Monfalcone have declared the sport un-Italian and banned it inside city limits. They claim that stray cricket balls could damage cars or other property, but it appears that the real reason for the ban is that cricket is popular among the Bangladeshi immigrants who have moved to the town to work in nearby shipyards. In other words, this looks like a thinly veiled form of discrimination.